Hello and welcome to part 8 of the Web API 2 tutorial with Entity Framework 6 which was originally contributed by the Microsoft team of uh, personnel led by Mike Wesson and uh, in this section you will be adding the ability to view details for each book. So in app.js file, we add the following code to the view model. So below the self.error, I will paste the code that I have copied from my clipboard. Also in the index.cshtml file, add a data bind element to the details link. So this data bind attribute will go after the href attribute. This binds the click handler of the anchor element to the get book detail function on the view model. And also in this file index.cshtml will give additional markup. So here where it is to do book details, we'll put the new code and just save all. Now this markup creates a table that is data bound to the properties of the detail observable in the view model. The this syntax KO syntax lets us include a knockout binding outside of a DOM element. In this case, the if binding causes this section of markup to be displayed only when the detail is non-null. Now if we run the application, once the application loads, Yeah, so it, if we click on the details link, nothing will happen. Uh, this uh, In the previous section, we saw that nothing has happened. Now we have given code, so it will show the details of the author, details of the author time, author title, year, genre, and price. That's it. Thank you for watching.